So I'm rebuilding a site for the Scamania Observer and I wanted to show you they've got a number of news articles. So we scanned through this recent edition of July 20th and when we go ahead and we choose to click on a tagged item, when we click on the tags, default Joomla has it going all in a row like that. And unlike blog layouts where I could easily choose to make it three in a row and do some other things, I, I still couldn't get other things in here like I wanted to have a link back to the category and a few other things that just weren't possible in the core Joomla. So I know I could write an override and in fact years ago I had written an override for tagged items but uh, it's not applicable anymore so I was excited when I jumped on over to Easy Layouts and was able to create some tagged layouts for Joomla 4 now. So any of you who have seen Easy Layouts in the past, uh, you, you already have an idea about it, but what it'll do is it will override in a bit more of a WYSIWYG way than doing it traditionally with code, and that works a little bit better for me. So we're just going to take a look at this uh, new layout that we've done in Easy Layout so you get an idea. Uh, and what you'll see is it is going to override this particular uh, Joomla layout from the tags and it's going to load all these different functions so obviously we would want the traditional ones about some statuses here and then I was able to add the category which wasn't an option I had in a core Joomla and I was able to do a couple other things including uh, easily making it three rows that's part of it here. I was able to put some code in here that I wanted. And so let's go ahead and see what happens when we apply it to our site. So now I'm back to our July 20th edition. And again, I go down to this sheriff's corner and click on the tag. And now when the page loads for these tagged items of sheriff's corner, it gives me a much nicer layout and in addition to that it gives me uh, the category which is what I wanted to have. 